Hi everyone, and welcome to another installment of Nintendo Direct. This time I'm coming to you from my office at Nintendo of America headquarters in Redmond, Washington. Today we've got some news about Nintendo 3DS, not only about upcoming games, but also about the Nintendo 3DS system itself. So let's get started. And why don't we begin with this? This is Nintendo 3DS XL. Its screens are 90% larger than those of the original Nintendo 3DS, meaning your handheld gaming experiences will be more intense and more engrossing than ever before. It has an updated form factor and will be available in red and blue and has a battery life that outperforms the original Nintendo 3DS. It comes bundled with a four gigabyte SD card, making it perfect for downloading content from the Nintendo eShop. We're launching Nintendo 3DS XL in North America at a suggested retail price of $199.99, and it'll be available in stores on August 19th, the same day that we release new Super Mario Bros. 2. That's the hardware, but I can't say enough about how Nintendo 3DS XL enhances the Nintendo 3DS gaming experience. Games like The Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Time 3D, Super Mario 3D Land, Mario Kart 7, and Kid Icarus Uprising really shine on those big screens, which are also a perfect fit for video applications like Netflix and Nintendo Video. The bottom screen is bigger too, meaning it's easier than ever before to create and share in SwapNote. Nintendo 3DS XL lets you get the most out of everything the Nintendo 3DS was made to do. The launch of Nintendo 3DS XL and New Super Mario Bros. 2 on August 19th marks the beginning of a huge push for Nintendo 3DS that'll last for the rest of the year and beyond. In this Nintendo Direct, we're going to give you more opportunities to take a closer look at the Nintendo 3DS XL and some of the games that you'll soon be able to play on it. I've asked Damon Baker from our licensing group to help give you an update on what developers outside Nintendo have been working on. So take it away, Damon. Thanks, Reggie. While the atmosphere is peaceful and serene here in front of the Zen Garden at Nintendo of America, our third-party partners are bringing explosive, dynamic, exciting game experiences to Nintendo 3DS, and the result is an absolutely packed release schedule for the rest of 2012. Here are just a few of the key titles you'll be playing before the year is up. In Castlevania, Lords of Shadow, Mirror of Fate from Konami, play as part of the famed Belmont clan and go up against the evil of Dracula himself. The game features four playable characters, including Dracula's son, Alucard, gigantic bosses, powerful weapons, and deep exploration. Trust me, you are going to need a map for this one. Skylanders Giants from Activision introduces more than 20 new interaction figures to collect, including giants that are twice the size of regular Skylanders and new light course Skylanders that light up in the game and in real life as they are placed on the portal of power. So my apologies in advance to parents everywhere. The Nintendo 3DS version of the game features its own unique storyline and exclusive 3D levels and gameplay options you won't be able to find anywhere else. D3 Publishers Adventure Time, Hey Ice King, Why'd You Steal Our Garbage? captures the random fun of the show and allows players to be Finn and Jake in the land of Ooh, exclusively on Nintendo 3DS and Nintendo DS platforms. Fans will be happy to know that the game features direct involvement by series creator and genius Pendleton Ward. LEGO The Lord of the Rings from Warner Brothers Interactive Entertainment and TT Games lets you play as your favorite Lord of the Rings characters as LEGO minifigures, complete with actual theatrical dialogue. You can expect the series' trademark humor and action puzzle gameplay. The Lord of the Rings is a natural fit for the LEGO franchise. I mean, you already have a character named Legolas. Also from Warner Brothers is Scribblenauts Unlimited. Help Maxwell solve robust puzzles and challenges by summoning any object you can imagine as you explore an all-new, side-scrolling open world. You can also utilize StreetPass to see all of the creative solutions to puzzles used by other players. Disney Epic Mickey Power of Illusion launches on November 18th and features gameplay exclusive to the Nintendo 3DS. Use the power of paint and thinner to work your way through the game using the Nintendo 3DS touchscreen as you battle the evil witch Miserabelle and save famous Disney tunes. In Sonic and All-Stars Racing Transformed, characters from the Sega universe battle for supremacy by driving unique transforming vehicles designed to race seamlessly on land, sea, and air. Just announced, NASCAR driver Danica Patrick is joining the All-Star cast as a playable character. 
And last, but definitely not least, Kingdom Hearts Dream Drop Distance from Square Enix launches on July 31st with Street Pass functionality, Dream Eaters that can be unlocked with AR cards, and support for the Circle Pad Pro. Additionally, a collector's edition will be available at launch called the Mark of Mastery Edition, the very first Kingdom Hearts collector's set released in North America. We think you're gonna love this game and are actually making a downloadable demo version available in the eShop, you guessed it, right now. So go check it out. While you're in the eShop, don't forget to download recently released demos for LEGO Batman 2, DC Super Heroes, and The Amazing Spider-Man. We also have demos coming soon for Rhythm Thief from Sega and Heroes of Ruin from Square Enix, so I hope you come back regularly and check out what's new. As Reggie said, the great new content for Nintendo 3DS is coming in XL size waves for the rest of the year. Here's my buddy JC Rodrigo from the Nintendo Treehouse to tell you more. If you watched us at E3, you probably know a lot about games like Luigi's Mansion Dark Moon and Paper Mario Sicker Star, both of which are coming to Nintendo 3DS later this year. But what don't you know about yet? Well, how about Professor Layton and the Miracle Mask? This is the first installment in this portable puzzle franchise developed exclusively for Nintendo 3DS and will launch in North America in November. The Professor Layton games are known for mixing mind-bending brain teasers with top-notch production values, and this game builds on that reputation. Fans and newcomers alike will enjoy a new adventure with the puzzle-solving duo of Layton and Luke and find out the story of Layton's high school days. Nintendo 3DS owners who have connected their systems to the internet will get the most out of this game, as we'll be releasing one downloadable puzzle a day for a full year starting immediately after the game is released at no additional cost. You know, I have more to tell you about Nintendo 3DS, but before I do, the one and only Nate Bildorf has something to share with you all. Thanks, JC. At E3 last year, we announced that we'll release a new game in the Super Smash Bros. series for Wii U and Nintendo 3DS. And today we'd like to share a little bit more about the game. We had originally planned to build a development team from scratch to create it, but the scope of the project, as well as our desire to deliver the game to fans in a timely manner, meant that we needed to take a different approach. We've partnered with Namco Bandai Games and Namco Bandai Studio on this project, and we'll be leveraging their experience and expertise to bring the game to life. Of course, Super Smash Bros. creator Masahiro Sakurai will act as game director, and will lead the production as he has on previous installments in the series. Alongside Mr. Sakurai, Masaya Kobayashi, who most recently worked on Go Vacation for Wii, and Yoshito Higuchi, who has directed the Tales series before, will lead a team of talented and experienced developers within Namco Bandai Studio. The team has been working on the game since Mr. Sakurai completed the development of Kid Icarus Uprising for Nintendo 3DS, and today we have special messages from Mr. Sakurai and Mr. Kobayashi that you can read on Nintendo.com. Now, let's talk about another game that's a perfect fit with the new Nintendo 3DS XL. There's a new game in the Art Academy series coming soon, and it lets you express your creativity in new and fun ways. This isn't just software that lets you draw on your Nintendo 3DS. You get actual art lessons that teach you real-world drawing and painting techniques with pencils, paints, and pastels. It's a great way to improve your drawing skills, whether you're working on the next great masterpiece or you just want to send better swap notes to your friends. The large screens of Nintendo 3DS XL let you literally go big with your creativity in a number of different ways. So, that's a lot of new information about Nintendo 3DS, but we've also got news for Wii. Everybody's favorite pink hero, Kirby, turns 20 this year, and we're celebrating by releasing Kirby's Dream Collection Special Edition for Wii. This special anniversary collection comes with six classic Kirby games, including my personal favorite, Kirby's Adventure, as well as a renewed collection of challenge stages based on last year's Kirby's Return to Dreamland. Beyond the games, you'll also get an interactive Kirby timeline, a music CD with songs from a variety of Kirby titles, and a full-color book chronicling the history of this video game icon. Now, if you're a fan, you'll love it. But if you've only ever played Kirby in Smash Brothers or have never played a Kirby game at all, it's the perfect introduction to everything Kirby. Changing gears. If you were following along at E3, there's a good chance the Pikmin series has been on your mind lately. 
If you're looking for something to play on Wii right now, I would strongly recommend Pikmin 2, the latest addition to our Nintendo Selects line, now available at a suggested retail price of less than 20 bucks. The game was a critical smash when first released on Nintendo GameCube, and it now features a revamped control scheme using the Wii Remote and Nunchuck that makes it an absolute joy to play. But Pikmin 2 also features some truly incredible multiplayer. I mean, people who have played it love it, and it definitely has a very passionate following within the Nintendo Treehouse. Honestly, I mean, Pikmin 2 is the perfect way to gear up for the release of Pikmin 3 on Wii U. Okay, back to Nintendo 3DS and new Super Mario Bros. 2. Coins have always been a big part of the Super Mario Bros. experience, but this game pushes the idea of coin collection to new extremes. It features new stages built around the idea of collecting as many coins as possible, and even features a new power-up that allows Mario to turn nearly everything around him into a seemingly endless source of cash. A few weeks ago at E3, we showed off a new game mode called Coin Rush. This mode uses Street Pass to exchange your scores with other players, challenging them to see who can collect the most coins across three stages in the shortest amount of time. Oh yeah, one other detail. You'll only have one life in Coin Rush, so it's a delicate balance of risk and reward that will help you net the best scores, and it'll keep you coming back for more, all the time. Want to see more on how new Super Mario Bros. 2 goes coin crazy? Let's check out a video. The sequel to New Super Mario Bros. has arrived for Nintendo 3DS. New Super Mario Bros. 2. And this time around, it's all about the coins. Discover all new ways to collect coins. Like gold rings. Touching a gold ring will turn all of your enemies into gold, and you'll get coins for defeating them. The new gold block turns Mario into a veritable coin factory. If Mario wears it on his head, coins will start popping out of it. And if he runs at full speed, the amount of coins increases. And let's not forget about Gold Mario, who can throw gold fireballs that turn blocks into coins. But that's just the beginning. There are many more coin-related items and features that can be found throughout the game. In the new Coin Rush mode, you'll play three randomly selected courses back to back, collecting as many coins as possible. You'll need to use all of your coin collecting and speed running skills to come out on top. Your remaining time and your position on the goal pole at the end of the course will be converted into coins. Once you've completed your Coin Rush, you can save your record and share it with other players via Street Pass. Records received through Street Pass can then be challenged. New Super Mario Bros. 2 also tallies every coin you collect, so you can keep track of how many you've collected since you first started the game. Do you have what it takes to collect 1 million coins? Good luck! New Super Mario Bros. 2 New Super Mario Bros. 2 launches on August 19. It's the perfect showpiece for Nintendo 3DS XL. It's also the first handheld Super Mario Bros. game to feature full local co-op play through the entire game, so you and a friend can play through the whole thing start to finish. Before I finish, I'd also like to share a bit about the new Fire Emblem game coming for Nintendo 3DS that we revealed at E3. This is turn-based role-playing strategy at its finest, and an entirely new entry in the series. It blends all the best game design features of past Fire Emblem installments into one ultimate quest, and it's coming next year. Back to you, Reggie. Thanks, JC. Speaking of New Super Mario Bros. 2, that game has a very strong link to our ongoing efforts to seamlessly connect players to their favorite game experiences through the internet. You already know that on August 19th, the game kicks off a new initiative for us, 
in which you'll be able to get the full game both in stores as a package product or as a download. But what we haven't yet shared is that we'll be making new downloadable Coin Rush stages available for purchase after the game comes out. After our developers finish working on the main game, and make no mistake, out of the box, this is a full-featured Mario game, as full-featured as we've ever made, they'll turn their attention to making even more stages so that you could keep playing Coin Rush mode again and again. I can't say how or when we'll be releasing these stages since they haven't even been made yet. But we're excited about the possibilities that online connectivity provides for helping players get more out of the games that they already love the most. The Fire Emblem game we're releasing in 2013 is another game that'll feature robust add-on content that's only available as a download and we'll have more information on that in the future. And if August 19th is just too long for you to wait, here are a few more things coming up in the Nintendo eShop that we think will help make the wait a little more bearable. First, we'll be making Super Mario Land, Mario's first ever handheld adventure, available for a download at a special price of $2.99 starting Friday, June 22nd through Sunday, June 24th. Next up, we've got an exciting July plan for the eShop. Starting on July 5th and running through August 1st, we'll be bringing you two great new virtual console games every week. Some of the featured games include The Legend of Zelda, Kirby's Pinball Land, and Wario Land, Super Mario Land 3, just to name a few. So be sure to check it out and come back every week to see what's new. For those of you who enjoy taking 3D photos with Nintendo 3DS, we're giving you a new way to see the amazing pictures taken by other users. Starting July 2nd, at photoshowcase.nintendo.com, you'll be able to submit 3D photos for a chance to be part of a curated online photo gallery called 3D Photos of the Week. The gallery will not only exhibit the best looking 3D photos, but it also lets viewers vote and share them through social media. Along with the gallery, we're also including some tips that'll help you put together some truly amazing 3D photos. We've shared a lot already in this installment of Nintendo Direct, but we're not done yet. Let's talk about Pokemon. With the recent release of Pokemon Conquest for Nintendo DS, 2012 has already been a big year for Pokemon, and it's only getting bigger. The Nintendo DS games, Pokemon Black version 2 and Pokemon White version 2, the successors to the acclaimed Pokemon Black and Pokemon White versions, will launch this fall. Taking place two years after the events of their predecessors, these games transport players back to the vibrant Unova region in a new adventure. The game is packed with Pokemon from previous games in the series that you'll encounter right from the start, and new Pokemon trainers and new gym leaders to battle. These games are playable in 2D on Nintendo 3DS and mark the first time we've ever released a direct follow-up to a core Pokemon role-playing game. Believe me, you don't want to miss them. And for those of you who'll be playing Pokemon Black 2 and Pokemon White 2 on Nintendo 3DS or Nintendo 3DS XL, you're in for a treat. We have two titles that'll be available for purchase from the eShop this fall that'll help you get the most out of these massive games. Pokemon Dream Radar lets you search for Pokemon through augmented reality. And it's the Pokemon that you catch that can be transferred into your Pokemon Black 2 and Pokemon White 2. The game includes hard to find Pokemon you might have trouble catching in other games like Tornadus, Thunderous, and Landorus and these will be featured in entirely new forms that you'll find first in Pokemon Dream Radar. And if you're wondering how you'll keep track of all the Pokemon you catch, Pokedex 3D Pro is the solution. It's an interactive database with information about every known Pokemon, which will enhance your Pokemon Black 2 and Pokemon White 2 play experience by detailing when Pokemon evolve, what moves they can learn, and how they stack up against other Pokemon in battle. Pokédex 3D Pro also lets you take photos of your favorite Pokémon in the real world through its unique use 
of augmented reality. That's a lot of information about Pokemon, and there's even more to learn before these games launch. We'll be able to share specific launch dates for all our upcoming Pokemon games soon, but I know you're eager for more. So let's take a first look at the English gameplay footage for Pokemon Black 2 and Pokemon White 2 right now. From Nintendo 3DS XL to the outstanding array of new games launching throughout the rest of the year, there's really no experience comparable to the handheld gaming fun of Nintendo 3DS. If you don't yet have a Nintendo 3DS, there's never been a better time to get on board. I hope you've enjoyed everything we've shared with you today, and thanks for watching.